In this video, you will learn how to make the classic mondials. You will see the two original methods using a spoon and the piping bag. You will also learn more about the funnel technique, which is the most efficient one. Enough talking, let's dive right into the spoon technique. The spoon method is the oldest one. For the ingredients, we will need Calibo Brazil Single Origin Dark Couverture, hazelnuts, almonds, candied oranges, candied cherries, pistachios. For the tools, we will need Take crystallized chocolate with your spoon, create some drops on a metal tray lined with parchment paper. Then tap the metal tray on the edge of the table to smoothen the surface of the drops. Right after, add the nuts and dried fruits before the chocolate sets. Finally, put in the fridge if necessary. As you see, this technique takes quite some time and rather labor intensive. The piping bag is a good method to quicken the process. For the ingredients, we will need Calibo Brazil Single Origin Dark Couverture, hazelnuts, almonds, candied oranges, candied cherries, pistachios, for the tools, we will need Pour some chocolate into the piping bag Cut a point off and create nice round drops on the parchment paper Then again, tap the tray to smoothen the drops surface Finally, quickly decorate with nuts and candied fruits. If necessary, put into the fridge at 10 degrees Celsius with a good air circulation until the chocolate has completely set. Quicker than the piping bag method, and for larger productions, I would suggest the funnel technique. For the ingredients, we will need Calibo Brazil Single Origin Dark Couverture, hazelnuts, almonds, candied oranges, candied cherries, pistachios, Calibo Dark Milk and White Chocolate Crisp Rolls, IBC Sparkling Powder. For the tools, we will need Make sure the chocolate is well pre-crystallized with the right amount of crystals. For more information on this procedure, please click below. Slightly preheat the funnel using a heating gun to prevent a thermic shock that will affect the chocolate gloss. Fill the funnel up to two-thirds with crystallized chocolate. Put the Teflon stick down to the bottom of the funnel to avoid any chocolate spillage. Prepare a tray with parchment paper and start to pour the chocolate into small flat drops by moving the Teflon stick up and down the funnel. Like this. Tap the metal tray gently on the table to smoothen the surface of the chocolate drops. Add the dried fruit, hazelnut and almonds on top of the chocolate layer. If you feel more creative, you can sprinkle some Calabot crystals Decorate it with or without sparkling powder on your mondials. They will add a crispy and playful touch to this classic product. Put into the fridge at 10 degrees Celsius with a good air circulation 
until the chocolate has completely set. Then leave at room temperature at 16 to 80 degrees Celsius. So here you see that with the funnel technique and within the same amount of time, we have created much more mendiants than when using the spoon or a piping bag. The funnel method also helps to make sure that the drops have a regular shape. Your classic pendillons are now ready to be enjoyed. You have learned three different techniques as well as some more original ingredients to decorate them. I'm really curious to see your creations, so please share them on social media with me using the following hashtags. Learn more about mendiants by watching my videos about the modern technique using molds. Until next time.